फिफ्थ क्वेश्चन फाइंड द आर्थो सेंटर ऑफ द ट्रायंगल ऑफ द ट्रायंगल ऊस वर्टिसेस ऊस वर्टिसेस आर फाइव कामा माइनस टू माइनस वन कामा टू एंड वन कामा फोर एंड वन कामा फोर फाइंड द आर्थो सेंटर ऑफ द ट्रायंगल उस वट्टी से सार फाइव कामा माइनस टू माइनस वन कामा टू एंड वन कामा फोर सो हाउ टू फाइंड आउट आर्थो सेंटर ऑफ द ट्रायंगल व्हेन द थ्री वट्टी से सफेद ट्रायंगल और गिवन और व्हेन द वट्टी से सफेद ट्रायंगल और गिवन सो दैट मींस फर्स्ट ऑफ़ ऑल वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द इक्वेशंस ऑफ एनी टू एल्टीट्य of the triangle we have to find out if you solve those two equations we get point of intersection that point of intersection of the altitudes or point of concurrence of the altitudes is known as ortho center of that given triangle so let us proceed this is a very simple manner i explained you very simple so first we have to find out equations of the two altitudes any two of the altitudes just solve them we get point of intersection that is the ortho center okay let us proceed for the problem okay let us start the problem suppose this is the triangle say a phi comma minus 2 b 1 comma minus 2 C one comma four. First, let us draw the altitudes. So this is AD is one altitude from A. This is other altitude. You draw it. Say B. This point of intersection is known as ortho center. Say H. That means if we know the equation of AD. If we know the equation of BE, the point of intersection of these two altitudes is nothing but ortho center. Okay, let us proceed. Process. Let the given vertices be a phi comma minus two. B one comma minus two and C one comma four. First AD equation we have to find out. AD is perpendicular to BC. That's why first slope of BC we have to find out. If you find slope of BC, slope of AD easily we can determine. How do we determine the slope of AD? Slope of AD is equal to Minus one by slope of BC. So first, let us find out slope of BC. So slope of BC, slope of BC. So slope of BC is equal to just formula we know y two minus y one by x two minus x one. That is four minus half minus four plus two by one minus one. So six by zero. That is generally undefined. So therefore, slope of AD is equal to one by minus one by slope of BC. Since 
AD perpendicular to BC. Minus 1 by 6 by 0, you get slope of AD is equal to 0. Slope of AD is equal to 0. Since here, here see once again, sorry, we have taken the B is minus 1, comma 2. This is my minus 1, comma 2. So, slope of BC will be here 1 plus 1, 2, this becomes 3. So, this will be minus 1 by 3. So, minus 1 by 3. Slope of AD is minus 1 by 3. Now, equation of AD. Equation of AD is equation of a line passing through phi comma minus 2 having slope minus 1 by 3. So, that means we have formula y minus y 1 is equal to m into x minus x 1. Using this we can find out. So, y plus 2 is equal to minus 1 by 3 into x minus 5. Cross multiplication takes place 3 y plus 6 minus x plus 5. Bring this side x plus 3 y plus 1 is equal to 0. Say equation 1. This is one of the altitudes. So, now in order to find out equation of B that is other altitude equation, first slope of C A find out. Slope of C A. Slope of C A is equal to minus 2 minus 4 by phi minus 1. This is minus 6 by 4 2 3 ja 2 2 ja minus 3 by 2. It is very careful. Now, slope of B we have to find out. Slope of B is equal to minus 1 by slope of C A. So, minus 1 by minus 3 by 2. So, which equal to 2 by 3. Am I correct? So, minus 1 by 2 by minus 3, we get 2 by 3. So, now how to find out equation of B? So, equation of B means it is a line passing through what minus 1 comma 2 having the slope 2 by 3. So, equation of B is again y minus y 1 is equal to m into x minus x 1. So, that implies y minus 2 y minus 2 2 by 3 into x minus of minus x plus 1 cross multiplication 2 x plus 2 3 y minus 6 bring this side 2 x minus 3 y plus 8 is equal to 0. This is equation 2. Now, having been actually found the equations of 2 altitudes 1 and 2. Now, solving this 1 and 2, we get point of intersection that is nothing but our answer that is ortho center. So, let us solve it. solving 1 and 2 for ortho center h ok. Now, from first equation you can write like this cross multiplication method 3 1 1 3 from second equation minus 3 8 2 minus 3 here x y 
वन ओके नाउ एक्स डिवाइडेड बाय ट्वेंटी फोर प्लस थ्री y divided by 2 minus 8 1 divided by minus 3 minus 6 x by 27 y by minus 6 1 by minus 9 so x is equal to 27 by minus 9 y is equal to minus 6 by minus 9 this is Three two ja three three ja. So therefore, h is equal to minus three comma two by three. This answer. 